Hey everyone, today I have a haul. Um, I placed a really big order on ASOS.com on the 13th of August and today is the 21st and it's already delivered which is awesome because that didn't take any time at all to come from the UK here to Canada in the middle of nowhere in Manitoba. So I'm going to jump right in and show you what I bought. I did have to pay some shipping for this. I had to pay $77.57 for it to be delivered through this some sort of company something DHL Express I've never heard of this um, delivery place before like in my life here it's like either FedEx or pure later or one that I'm forgetting but I've never heard of this one before so I don't know but whatever I really like this stuff on ASO so I don't have a problem spending $77 on shipping I really don't care so I have this enormous bag just like Filled with things. I think I got six things. I already opened it so I didn't have to like struggle doing that with my nails on camera. So let's get into the goods. Ooh, I forgot about this. Okay, so this first thing is like a peplum eyelash shirt. Oh my god, I forgot about this. So this first thing, I hope it'll fit in the screen. It's like a peplum shirt and it has eyelashes on it. Isn't that cute? Some of them are some of them glittery? I feel like... Oh no, they're not. Okay, they're just like matte on there. Um, yeah, it just has little eyelashes on it. I thought this was so cute. So I bought this cute little peplum shirt with the little eyelashes on it. This might be a little big on me. We'll see. ASOS sizes, that's one thing about ASOS. Their sizes are just like so weird and I never know what size yet. I've ordered from them twice before and like each size of different clothing is just like such a strange size for me. But anyway, this is just made out of some like sort of jersey fabric and it kind of goes out with the size. That's so weird. This is going to be really comfortable. So this eyelash peplum was originally $35.67 and I got it for $17.63. What else do we have in here? I have no idea what this is. Oh, right. I ordered some floral print, like, block leggings. Ooh. So they just have a strip of floral print right down the center of them. I hope these are going to be long enough for my legs. This doesn't really look that long. I think I'm going to just have to wear these with boots. I'm pretty sure I got these, like... A really good deal like I got this like 50% off or something I think these were around 16 bucks I should be looking at the prices of these these leggings yeah I got these leggings for $16 and they were originally 32 so like really stretchy it must be like a poly blend or something oh this was the thing I was most excited about oh. Ooh, this next shirt is like a pop art print shirt. And it does have a step hem. A step hem is like a really defined hem where it is one length in the front and one length in the back. It's kind of like a high-low but a little bit different. So here it is right here. It has a three-quarter sleeve and I love this. Ooh. This pop art um, step hem tunic I got for $21 and it was originally $35. This feels like it's like a cotton fabric. This is so pretty. Ooh, this is neat. I'm gonna put all the links to all these articles of clothing that I bought down there in case anyone is wanting to get one of these. So this is like sort of a shirt dress, it's like a high-low kind of thing, and this is like pure elastic, it's really stretchy. Okay, so it's just a kind of high-low shirt, and it has these awesome colored studs on these shoulders. Isn't that so neat? Oh my goodness, I just want to put this on right now, and it's like never-ending. <laughs> I want to put this on right now. So this one was originally $53 and I got it for $32. Look at those studs. These are like in there pretty good I feel like. They're sturdy in there. Ooh. Pretty. 
Next is, this is like the reason why I placed the order because I really thought this shirt was like adorable. So I had to get it. And I'm looking at their website right now for this shirt and I paid full price for this which was $53 but now it's on sale and it's only $37. That kind of bums me out but I'm glad I got it anyway. So this is the contrast panel blouse with drop collar and it is just a really beautiful kind of professionally looking uh, really adorable blouse and the reason I got this is because it is a bit longer in the back. It's kind of like a high-low. I don't even know if you're going to be able to see it. So the back of it is kind of longer than the front and when it's on it looks so cute. I might insert a picture of the model wearing it and you can see it's just like super adorable. It's really cute and it's just a really lightweight comfortable fabric. Oh this is really pretty. I want to put this on right now too. And the last thing, which was like the best deal in the world. This jacket was originally $115, but I got it for $69. And it's like taking up the entire bag. It's this cute, like so cute polka dot jacket. I needed just like a light jacket instead of just like winter parkas. Because in Vancouver, I don't think I'm going to be wearing like my winter jacket. So I just needed a lightweight jacket. So I got this one. This feels so nice. Oh jacket I think I may have gotten too big of a size though but we shall see so it's just an adorable polka dot print and it has black buttons on it they're all covered right now but they are black buttons and the reason I got this is because it's so cute on the back there's like shoulder pads in this it's so weird there's like shoulder pads on the back there's a bow do you see the bow isn't that so cute where the belt goes like the belt goes through the bow oh this is adorable so it does have a belt at the waist that tightens and then it flares out at the bottom so yeah i just got this adorable little i'm gonna call it my rain jacket so that is all the stuff I ordered off of ASOS. I really, really love their website. They just have such a great selection for like plus size people and it's awesome. So if you want to check it out, I will put a link down there and you can like go to their website. If you don't want to necessarily Google it, you can click down there. And yeah, that's about it. So I'll see you guys later. Bye. Looks like Ariel. It looks like under the sea. Um, so here are the pretty colors. I haven't touched 